Okay, we're here to do some QuickTime screen recording. Um, it's a quick and easy and free way of recording your screen so you can make these neat YouTube videos or explainer videos or something like that. So you'll just launch QuickTime Player. But you probably notice that when you do run it, there's no way to record the audio of the computer itself, just the microphone. Um, so if you start recording something, click. So now I'm, I'm actually recording and I'm going to fire up Safari here and play a video. So We can hear the video, no problem. Okay, kids, let's go. But in the screen recording, there's no audio. Which kind of sucks. So the solution to this is to install a uh, an audio input for your computer. And we're going to use something called Soundflower, uh, which you can grab at this URL here. It'll be in the description down below. So you don't need to copy and paste it, but there it is. We'll download it and install it. All right, we're installing. Oh, we're not allowed to install it. Okay, so we right click click open and then all of a sudden we can do it type in my super secure password my life is a progress bar might as well drink some coffee oh there we go now we look at system preferences under sound under output we'll see soundflower we're going to click this little thing down at the bottom so we can see the volume in the in the menu bar you'll see that it's going to soundflower now all audio from your computer is going to soundflower so now uh, launch quicktime which is in here and start recording the screen click this little arrow and we're going to record Soundflower. So the output of the computer is going to go into the QuickTime screen recording. We're going to record the whole screen. There we go. Now we're recording. And we can go back and watch that video. But here's the thing. We're not actually going to hear the video. Because audio is going to Soundflower and Soundflower is going to QuickTime. We're not going to hear it. But that's okay. Because you're we are capturing it though yeah let's go to spatula city so I'm gonna stop recording that video and preview my little screen recording and guess what we don't hear any audio because our output is still set to um, Soundflower switch it back to digital out now we should be able to hear it. Buddy, where's the spatula? Okay, kids, let's go. There you go. That was easy. So now we can use, well, we could save that if we wanted to, which of course I want to keep it. Test. Um, so now we have a screen recorder that was free and it does audio. How great is that? 